You know, I'd like to think that I deliver a flawless 42 minutes of television every night, and I'm sure you agree. And if you don't, well, then we have a segment called The Public Viewer, where my good friend, Brian... Actually, you know what? I'm not going to lie to you. He's not my good friend. I don't even like him. He's well, here. Well, Hi, Brian. Hi. How are you, Glenn? Mm. Mm. You know, you're here. Well, I know, and I'm, I'm, I'm actually excited to be here with you. Yeah. Uh -huh. And I'm, I'm glad to be back, glad yeah. to be monitoring you. And uh, Eric, my, my assistant, said he wanted to put together a, a retrospective to get us back in the mode. Yeah. Get us all excited to remind us uh, what we've missed for the last few months. Sure, sure. So let's roll that, shall okay. we? Mm -hmm. So once again, we're here for the least favorite segment, the public viewer. Now a guy that I would like to put into a capsule and shoot him out into the moon, Brian Sack. <laughs> Here's another prediction for you. I'm going to hate the next segment because this guy is on. Brian Sack, welcome to the program. Nah, no, not so much. Is there a reason why you're on? You have one segment a week to do, and it, it sucks this much? The sound of your contract. Get out of here. What a loser. All right, let's... And it's weird because those feelings, some feelings... Never change. Okay, well, <laughs> that wasn't as uplifting as I thought it would right. be. No, it's really not. All right, well, let's move on to critiquing you. Uh -huh. uh, something I learned from uh, mom and dad was, uh, you know, you don't ask people how much they weigh, you don't ask them how old they are, and you don't ask them this. What are you pulling down a year now? Oh, I, I don't want to say that. <laughs> what are you pulling down a year? Me? Yeah. What are you pulling down a year? Uh, <laughs> what are I you love doing? It. I love that. I love <laughs> that. They loved it, you too. You would be surprised how many people, at, I challenge you at home, do this. Just ask people, what are you pulling down a year? It just stops I, them in their tracks. It, I'm tell, no, I'm telling you, it, except for the uber rich, they'll answer. They'll tell you right away. So how much are Brian, you pulling down? <laughs> hey, Brian, how much are you pulling down? Not a lot. You're signing yeah, the checks. There you go. All right. Now, it's another thing. almost $12 an hour. At, le at least. I'm a, a little bit above Starbucks. Right. Because I have no coffee skills. Really? You're making more than Starbucks? Yeah. Remind well, me the lower is... Well, I'm sorry. Go ahead. <laughs> yes, sir. Uh, another thing that, that worries me a lot, because I'm on the show, I want the show to stay on the air, and you have a lot of, you know, watchdog groups, people out there, they're, they're short and they're angry and they're mad at you, sure. and they're always trying to get you in trouble. Mm -hmm. And uh, so they're always looking for that thing they can take out I the mean, contest. I mean, I got big breasts. Is it? You know, they're, they're trying to take stuff like that. Well, why would you say something like that? They, they're going to take it out of context. True. I mean, gonna... Why do you think I'm wearing such a dark brown shirt tonight? You can't see the actual breastage uh, with a shirt like this. Now, some guy's going to hear that. He's going to scurry off his stool, run over, and start faxing out a press release that you're a transsexual. Look, I'm not saying that I'm a transsexual. I'm not not saying I'm a would transsexual. Would you play one on here. TV? <laughs> um, Okay, moving on. Yes. This is something I noticed the other day, uh -huh. uh, and it smelled funny to me. This is an issue of national security and of the, the laws that are fragrantly being disregarded by millions of people. <laughs> I, you know, I... Fragrantly? <laughs> that smells weird. I know. I know. I'm sorry. You are smelling up the laws I'm of this sorry. country, sir. All right, go ahead. We've got 30 seconds. We've got 30 seconds. Okay. Well, it's Fleet Week, so welcome to all the sailors and soldiers in New York City. Yeah. And uh, just, you know, they're going to go out. They might get a little too boozy, and they might need a place to stay at night. That's why I've been handing out flyers uh, with this. It's Glenn Beck's Sailor Sleepover, May 23rd to the 30th. Sailors welcome. <laughs> this really doesn't, this doesn't help, especially since I, I guess I've just said that I'm a transvestite. Brian, thanks well, a lot. You never know. Now we go from zeros to heroes.